Hello everyone. Welcome to our Gardening Ideas channel, where there are always unique and special creative ideas that can be applied in practice. For more details, please watch this video to see how we do it. Is it really effective? Is it helpful to you? Is it unique and have you seen it anywhere before? If you find it interesting, please like, subscribe to the channel and share this video with everyone. And today I will bring you a unique idea with the combination of fish and vegetables have you seen it anywhere? First, we need to prepare an iron frame to create a pond shape suitable for the garden area. Fix them firmly. Then cover them with a layer of waterproof tarpaulin to fix them. Spread another layer of cover on top, followed by a thin layer of soil. Then use rope to fix them into even holes. Collect all the used plastic bottles to make plant pots. Process them into small pots. Prepare the soil that has been mixed with enough nutrients for them into the prepared bottles and then arrange them in prefixed rows. Isn't everything great? Now just fill it with water and we have a small pond and beautiful hydroponic vegetable beds. We need another pack of hydroponic vegetable seeds. Treat the vegetable seeds before sowing by soaking them in water and removing the damaged seeds. Plant the prepared seeds in the bottles arranged in rows in the tank and then wait for them to germinate and grow well. It's great to observe the growth process of the seeds, isn't it? When the seeds have germinated and grown for a week, it's time to release the fish. The type of fish I chose is catfish. Oh, what a breakthrough idea. Have you thought about the combination of vegetables and fish? I think it's quite good. Everything is so different after a month. It's so exciting to see the lush green vegetable beds. What do you think? Leave a comment below and don't forget to support me with a like, a channel subscription and a share so I can develop more good ideas. Two months later, things were completely different. The fish were also growing healthy and mature. The unique idea had very impressive results. The fish have grown up. They seem to be very suitable for living in this environment. Do you think this is an ideal farming model that will yield high yields? Leave a comment below. Three months after cultivation the results were amazing. I think it's time for us to harvest. The results are surprising, right? Having vegetables to eat all year round and having fish weighing about 1 to 2 kilograms. I didn't think it would be so successful. Now that you've seen it, why don't you give me a like, a channel subscription and a share? A similar idea with a beautiful pink fish. A highly artistic combination. Gives us a relaxing feeling after stressful working days. The agricultural engineer took advantage of a tarpaulin tank used in the previous crop to renovate it and then pump water into it to prepare for his project. The pink fish were bought in preparation for a new harvest. Once the tank reached a certain water level, 
The fish were released and took advantage of their new ideal living environment. Before releasing them into a new environment, we need to let them get used to the new environment for about an hour so that they can gradually adapt and not get shocked. This ensures that the fish will live well when released. An ideal living environment full of oxygen and camouflaged by duckweed and water hyacinth. They have the effect of balancing the living environment and effectively filtering the water to help fish grow healthily. With suitable stocking density, the fish grow very healthy. We pumped in more water to make the fish live at a more comfortable density and also to prepare to plant more hydroponic water spinach on the surface of the pond to create an additional food source for the fish and to use it as a hiding place for the fish. We prepared the pots with plastic baskets lined with mesh. Then put the pre-processed soil in and sowed the water spinach seeds in them. A job that needs to be meticulous to ensure that all the seeds germinate and grow well after sowing. Then we cover them with black mesh to ensure moisture for them and weight. See the results after a week all have sprouted healthy. Take extra care to ensure more plants. After two weeks the plants have grown well. We can release them into the lake. Fix them in a row by tying them to small bamboo sticks and plastic bottles to form a raft to ensure they do not sink when we release them into the water. The vegetable rafts are released into the lake. Isn't it wonderful? We call this water spinach raft. We don't need to water it but still have vegetables to eat regularly. It looks so pleasing to the eye, doesn't it? The water spinach rafts are growing very well. The fish are also very healthy and seem to enjoy having an additional source of food. Have you ever done it like me? Please leave a comment below if you don't understand clearly. Thank you for taking the time to watch this video. I hope everyone enjoys watching the video. If you find it interesting, please leave a like and comment below. Please subscribe to the channel and share the video with your friends and relatives.